I turn around and it was Brett. I took his hand and we ran to the boy's bathroom. We go into the bigger stall and he lifted up my skirt and started eating me out. It was all very new to me but it felt good so I let it happen. I started breathing all funny and he went faster. Oop. The next thing I know, he is completely hard and he asked if I wanted to have sex. By that time I was really horny, so I said yes. He pulled it out, and tried to put it in. He said damn you're tight, but he ends up getting it in. He had a big pee pee so it kinda hurt, but it also felt good. I start to let out a soft moan, but he covers my mouth and whispers in my ear you can't do that baby. My kitty said beating hard. We end up doing that every day during various classes. Anyway now we are married and I don't regret it at all. One day my boy best friend came over to my house to hang out. While we were upstairs playing on my PlayStation my mom told us to come eat and as we were going down the stairs he tripped and smacked my ass but I didn't say anything because he was low key hot. After we got done eating we went back upstairs and I asked him if he meant to smack my butt and he said yes and I asked why and he asked me if it was a problem and I said no because I liked him. So he pinned me to the wall and asked me if this is what I wanted and he started to kiss me all over and made me feel good then he pinned me to the bed and ate me out. I started to hear my mom come upstairs so we put our clothes back on. After my mom went back to sleep I sucked on his thing and we did the dirty and it made me feel so good and we still do it to this day and my mom and dad don't know from anonymous. Story time. So when I was in 8th grade a girl walked up to me and said I was cute. 8 minutes later she came back up to me and asked if I wanted to go to her house I said sure. Then she told me she had a boyfriend and me being the little shit that I am. I said I didn't care. We started making out in her room and her boyfriend came over he knocked on the door and said her name. I quickly put my shirt on and started acting gay right when he walked in I faced the girl and started fake crying I said. My boyfriend broke up with me yesterday. The girl's boyfriend came up to me and said it's okay bro then he hugged me. Long story short I actually turned gay and started dating her boyfriend. Oh this one time it was like a 5 months ago my brother wanted to go to his friend's house and keep in mind I was H0 RNY and so when we got to his place his parents weren't home so when we got to his house he was showering and I needed to use the restroom but I went to the other one so when I went back to his room my brother was there just sitting on the bed but not being weird or anything so my brother had to go back home to get a game and so my brother left and he told me if I wanted to stay or if I wanted to go with him but I said I'll stay and my brother said if I stay then to tell his friend let's call him Rex so Rex came out of the shower and I thought he had clothes on but I was wrong so he came out of the shower naked and I could see his fine ass abs and he only had a towel on and so I'm guessing he didn't see me and so the towel dropped and I seen his ding dong and omg it was so big and I mean so big and he saw me and he was still naked and he said where is her brother and I said he went to get a game from home and my brother's friend. So this one bitch. Emma call her Lily. She would do countless things for attention. She would say the N word and she is whiter than paper. And she would say she is so depressed BC she doesn't have a phone. She would make lines in her arms with pencils so make it seems like she cuts. And everybody would comfort her. And the big dumb. Bubble gum. Trump supporting. Greasy hair. Stick body. Flat butt girl used me to get close to my ex whom I was friends with. And she expected you give her her food but you get one crumb of her and you would get slapped. Thank you for your submission. My first time I did the dirty I was in 8th grade and had a super fucking hot boyfriend I snuck over to my boyfriend's house in the middle of the night while his entire family was home. As we were starting to get into it, his dad yells his name and before we even realized what was happening the door swung open and his dad made full eye contact with my butt ass naked self with my boyfriend inside of me it was so fucking awkward his parents told us come downstairs. In 5 minutes so I made a plan to fake a call to my friend who was pretending to be my mom and told my boyfriend to call an Uber we went downstairs and while my boyfriend's parents were yelling at us I took the call and went to the front room, where I hauled ass out the front door. So when I was at home my brother asked if I wanted to go to the mall, so we went and as we got there I needed to go to the bathroom, 
There was a guy he was probably like 19 and him 18 so he said hey and went into the women's bathroom I said what are you doing and he bought me into a stall he was hot though so like I didn't mind. I saw him take off his shoes I was like damn why not so I went along with it because I was curious and he took all his clothes off and the last thing was you know and I was prepared too. He said come here so I walked to him he said turn around. And I did I was on top of him and we did some good stuff and until that day no one knows but it was great he also gave me his phone number and wanted me to go to his house this was one week after so I did go to his house and he was alone I told him I was there and to open the door I heard him coming down the stairs I was kind of excited for some damn reason he opened and Four of my friends and I decided that we wanted to get barred out for a party last year. We bought 30 zans and a shit ton of alcohol and man let me tell ya we were fucked up when we got to the party some random dude came up to me and asked if I wanted some of his drink. My barred out ass decided to grab his cup and take a giant gulp and as soon as I tasted the drink I realized it was molly water minutes later I was rolling. Drunk and barred out but my friends decided it was time to go to the next party so we got in the car and not even 5 minutes into the drive everyone was too fucked up to function including the driver who passed out at the wheel and ran straight into the side of a house. One day I woke up and it was cold as fuck and I mean polar bear pussy cold. I decided to take a hot and steamy creamy dreamy shower when all of a sudden my kazala kazaka huchala puchala zakaka kakaka kalacha chapazachala zachapachala chatacha started aching severely. The pain was that unbearable I fell onto the floor and started crying. And my mom heard me and she ran in. My mom rushed me to the hospital and asked the doctor what's wrong with me. The doctor told my mom to leave so she can ask me some questions. And one of them being am I pregnant. I said I don't know and I took a pregnancy test and it tested positive and I shit myself on the hospital bed. They had to bathe me and I got sent out and my mom said what's wrong with me and I said it was just period cramps. Y'all please help me how do I tell my mom I'm pregnant I'm so scared omg. Okay so when I was in senior year of high school my history teacher was having a baby so we got a sub. And when I tell you he was hot. He was like Draco Malfoy meets young Leonardo DiCaprio. He was finger licking good sweaty red face with tongue out. In history class he would stare at me and I would blush. One day he came over to me when we were writing our papers and he asked if I needed help after school. I said yes because I wanted I wanted to do the Humpty Dumpty with him. He came over and we started studying. He put his hand on my thigh and at first I was like pack it up Tony Lopez Shane y'all looking ours. But then I remembered the goal winking face. I gave him the gluck gluck 3000. And then we had sex. I found out I was pregnant. 